having fun with your extracurricular activities. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? You know, all the extra work you've been doing. You should be getting paid overtime for working so hard, so late. Why do you always have to work late, Mum? We've been over this, darling. Mum has a really important job. It's like a big competition where the best win. And Mum is the best. You're the best as well. Certainly the best cook in this family. Right. Bedtime. Oh, really? Yep. Come on, Dylan. I'll tuck you in. Oh, Dad, can't you do it? Listen to your mum. No. That's all right. I'll uh, clean up here. You take him up. I'm going to have to cancel tonight. Why? What's wrong? It doesn't matter. I just can't make it, okay? Okay. So when can I see you? <sighs> Let's play it by ear. I'll text you. Hughes, you didn't disappoint. I had a look through your examination results. They're very strong. Well, thank you very much, sir. I am ready to take on the challenge. Not quite yet. I want to give Amy another shot. We're going to do another round of interviews. Just the two of you. What? But she has next to no experience. I'm your lead on this. This assignment means a great deal to me. There's a long personal history attached to this. You can understand why I want to be absolutely sure I have the right person. Why her, though? I'm not afraid of a little competition. Okay. Bring it on. There she is. The next station is Platt Square. Previously on Last Stop. Did you see that guy just then? I keep seeing him bringing home different girls, but I've not seen one of them leave. Let's follow him. I want his number. Holy shit! Get a video of this! <laughs> Leg it! Help! We need to move him. Let's get him inside, out of sight. Where the hell are you?
Um, here she is. Right. This is not on. You told Mum you'd text her. You didn't. You said you'd be at the Vex house. You weren't. We were worried about you, Donna. Is everything okay? Just a moment, Ash. I'm not finished. Where the hell were you, Donna? Where are your friends? What prevented you giving us even a courtesy text? I'm really, really sorry. It won't happen again. I had to come out here this late. I have work in the morning. Mum's got enough on her plate. You were out with Vivek again, right? Where is he? He's just hanging out. I wonder how Vivek's dad feels about his son staying out all hours. Why don't I ask him while we're here? I bet he'll appreciate me knocking on his door in the middle of the night. No, please don't do that. Babe, it's pretty late. Perhaps we should all just go home. Oh, perfect. My fiance's taking your side now. I don't know what's happened with you, Donna. You're always in your head. You're never at home. You never help around the house. Okay, I get it. I'm a total screw up. Are you happy now? Let's just talk about this in the morning. Fine. I've done all I can. You two can sort it out amongst yourselves. I know Em can come on a bit strong at times, but she loves you. She has your best interests at heart. I know, Ash. Can we please just drop it, though? You seem a bit anxious. Has something happened? Just tired. I'm not your sister. I'm not going to ask where you were. But you can always tell me if you're in trouble. I promise. Nothing to worry about. I love your sister, Donna. I just want us all to be safe and get along. Happy and safe. Got it. You're sure nothing happened tonight? There's nothing wrong? Hundred percent. Okay. Let's get ourselves home before I get a scolding too. <laughs>